John Mullen was born in the state of Vermont in the latter part of the 1700s. He was raised as a master mason in Western Star Lodge No. 239 in Buffalo, New York sometime in 1816. Soon afterwards, he journeyed west to Michigan. He was a surveyor by occupation and at one time held the position of county surveyor for Wayne County. On September the 5th, 1821, the Grand Lodge of New York granted to John Mullet and others a warrant for holding a lodge in the city of Detroit, Territory of Michigan, by the name of Detroit Lodge No. 337, now No. 2. He was the first master of this lodge, serving two years. He held no official position in the first Grand Lodge that had an existence from 1826 to 1829 but was a prominent and influential member of the Grand Lodge of 1841-44 to 44, and was elected its most worshipful Grand Master at the annual meeting in 1844. On the dissolution of that body and the organization of the present Grand Lodge on September the 7th, 1844, he was elected its first Grand Master and was installed into that office by past Grand Master General Lewis Cass. He was re-elected the following year. He was also an active worker in York Rite Masonry. In 1848, he was High Priest of Monroe Chapter No. 1 of Detroit and participated in the convention that organized the Grand Chapter of Michigan. He was elected the Grand Scribe at the chapter meeting and was a constant attendant and an active worker in the meetings of the Grand Body for several years. He died on January 15, 1862.